Hey YouTube, it's your boy Ricardo, back again with another video, and today I'm going to show you how to install 4.2.2 .2 for the Motorola Atrix 4G from AT&T. In order to do this, you need to be rooted and you need to have your bootloader unlocked. and also have a custom recovery. Which I'm using Twerp recovery. Bootloader unlocked, as you can see. Team win recovery. Now what you need to do is a factor reset. This is version 2.5.0.0 in case you're wondering. This is showing you all the things that are happening. You also need to go to advanced wipe and click on Dalvit and system and then sw swipe like so. Okay, now click back, back again, back again, and now click install. Now locate the file, the zip file, and it's being stock 1.179 from 2013 405. And just swipe right away. When this happens, don't freak out. It's going to tell you what you want on your ROM. Click agree. Just cache and delve it. Make sure you do that. And just click forward. Okay. Would you like tweet or non tweet ROM? That's up to you. I'm gonna hit standard. Okay. It's telling you re ready to install. Happy with your choices. Choose install. If not, choose start over. Just click in install. Click OK. And then just click forward, and it's just going to do everything. You see the percent over here? And it's telling you what's installing. This ROM is A O K P ROM. So it's going to be many features. You take advantage on your Motorola Atrix. Just give it some time. Almost done. Now you click next and reboot your device now. And just swipe it. Now it's gonna do magic over here. And now it's rebooting, as you can see. I'm 
I'm gonna provide links on how to unlock your bootloader and how to root it. Remember, this is only, only Motorola Atrix devices that are rooted and have their bootloader unlocked. If you don't have that, don't consider you doing this because it won't work. This is like the boot animation, being stock boot animation. Give it a second. Excuse me for the background noise. If you like videos like this, make sure to subscribe me. Now, there's this menu coming up. You got Hollow Launcher HD or Toe bucket. I use this one and just click always. And I was going to tell you how to use things. There's a home screen right here. Pull down notification. Everything works pretty much. You got 4.2. Screen right here. Let's go to system. Let's check about phone. As you can see, Android version 4.2.2. Jelly Bean. This is a pretty new ROM. It's from April 3, Wednesday, 2013. And it's build 179. I'm going to test this out. I might do a review on it, on how it performs. As you can see, you have your own themes as well. You can have dark stock or just normal. I'll just keep it like this. Looks much better. You can see they improved. Now you got all these menus. Pie control. As you can see. You got navigation bar. Now you have this on the bottom, as opposed to having this if you want, which is really nice. So far, I'm liking this run. First boot up. It looks sick. You also have this color scheme on the keyboard, which is really cool. And I have that animation again. unlock and you got this too you can go to your 
on your home screen, you can go to your uh, camera. You need to have internal storage or external. But you can fix that problem. It's running, it's running really smooth. You can see Wi Fi works, which is really important. Most things work. GPS works, I think. All right, guys, until next time, it's your boy Ricardo. Make sure to subscribe me. Leave a comment below if you want me to make a review on this ROM, if you're interested. Like button if you like this video. Until next time.